uh, Jürgen, I'd like to start with you. Uh, what do you make of, of the fact that the German government seems to be taking a light-handed approach to this issue? Uh, all the lists comprise, uh, comprise approximately 25,000 names. So this would be uh, a mass murder, which is incomprehensible, if all those names on those lists were likely to be targets of murder attacks. Mm. Uh, the federal government in Germany has only the competences to protect the borders, to protect uh, railway stations and um, flights. Uh, aircraft uh, oh. flights. Uh, they can collect data in a central office, but uh, the policemen in the streets uh, are employed by the 16 individual states that we have in Germany. So uh, there is no competence of the federal level uh, okay. to protect individual journalists who might feel unsafe. But do you think, Jürgen, that they should be doing more, considering it's not, as, as I use the example of that German politician, Walter Lubko, uh, who, was, who was killed on June 2nd, you know, this is a very real threat, isn't it? Yeah, uh, this uh, was a murder. Uh, there was an, uh, another murder committed by an immigrant uh, who pushed a child and his mother uh, in front of a train at a railway station. Uh, this is uh, also a horrible experience. Uh, 